Say something. Hello. Mm, mm, still a laptop. Mm, mm, still a laptop. Mm. Hi, we're Goldfish and you're watching Infusion TV. Right, Infusion TV, welcome. South African Freedom Day, Sundance Beach. I'm here with Goldfish. Welcome, guys. How's How are you doing? Very well. How's it, how's Back happening? for the third, fourth time, right? Where, where? Yeah, at least, I think, uh, Dubai. Time, Dubai. Time, six times. Who's counting? Who's counting? Who's counting? Second home. Right, lo last night in Doha, so for the Freedom Day over there, how did that go? That was rocking. We had yeah. a good crowd. We had a, a couple of, what do you call them? Qataris. Qataris. Yeah, 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 yeah. As well, yeah, which is yeah. awesome as well, you know. Okay, okay. And uh, yeah, we rocked out. So we're looking forward to rocking out tonight as well. Cool, yeah, so it's so African Freedom Day. We're in Dubai. What does uh, South African Freedom Day, what does it mean to you? I mean, we're we South Africans, we come back from, you know, the past, and here we are celebrating, and what, what does it mean to you? I mean, well, you first, you first. Well, you know, I think it's the day that we, that everybody had their voice, you know? Yeah. Everyone got to have their voice. I think it's probably the, one of the most, one of the more meaningful days for South Africa for the current uh, era. Right, you know? right, right. There's right. a lot of public holidays which have kind of like changed names. Yeah, and just yeah, 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 yeah. Just, you know, and which have sort of a, a sorted past. This one yeah. is kind of like a pure, you know, it's, this as is, a this name. Is real. I mean, this to me, to me, it's just like a special day. To me, it feels real. I'm honored to be here and celebrate it. Right. Oh, I feel like uh, I mean, this is the day that we were welcomed back into the world as a as a country that you know everyone was proud of again. And yeah. um, I mean, you just have to look behind you and just see how many proud South Africans there are jumping exactly. around the sand. The vibe is amazing. As soon as you say, are there any South Africans in the house? I mean, the whole place just went mental. So Right, right. We're, we're, we're like the Mafia. We're everywhere. South <laughs> Africans, we're taking over the world. Right. So i got to ask this goldfish. I mean, where, I mean, where does this ridiculous name come from? Come on. <laughs> Come well, on. Uh, who's gonna answer? Uh, you go on, Okay, go on, go on, I'll go take this one yeah. since it's my fault. Uh, Dave, <laughs> Dave always used to call me a goldfish when we were young. We actually met studying at the University of Cape Town, studying music, and uh, I was always losing my phone. I used to leave my phone on the roof of my car and drive off. I'd lose my right, wallet right, or my right. keys. Or I was just, I was a goldfish basically, right, and uh, right. I've got a lot better. Okay. And Dave's had his few goldfish moments, but when we were looking for a, we actually, we Dave, actually, you want to talk we actually about have it? a uh, goldfish floating trophy now. <laughs> who leaves the worst thing behind? Like leaving your iPad in the pouch in the plane, that kind of thing, you know. So like DJing must be difficult with the eight second memory, right? I mean, <laughs> three seconds, come on. Three seconds. That's great, we get to play the same song all day, all night. <laughs> the worst part is, is just looking up and not realizing where you are, you know. Right, like, right, right. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But, uh, right, so next question. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry, that's better than waking up and not knowing where you are. <laughs> that's happened to me, trust me. <laughs> this morning, actually. Right, so Goldfish, where are we at right now? What's going on? I mean, there's, there's rumors of EMI, there's albums, there's like... It's there's not so a rumor. We, we signed a deal with EMI out of the, based out of the Netherlands. Right. And uh, that album's coming out in June. The album title is Goldfish. It's like the reintroduction. Who thought of that? Hold on, who thought of that name? Actually, who thought of that we have name? to credit it to uh, the, the, main, the, main, the, main, the main guy from EMI was like, Oh, I think we should call it Goldfish. We're like, <laughs> we're like, sweet. We don't have to think of a bloody name. You know? Can we like, use that voice exactly? So, yeah, 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 yeah. Something like that. Something like that. Right. I can't Sorry, really do a Belgian accent. So. Sorry to interrupt. Um, yeah. So, two two awesome new songs. The first single is coming out in like uh, mid May. Okay. And then the album's dropping in June. Cool, cool, uh, cool. Just preceding our sold out show at Amsterdam the Boss in mm -hmm. Amsterdam. Nice, five thousand nice. tickets sold out today. Easy. Yeah. Well, not easy. Five thousand here, by the way. No problem. Yeah. <laughs> and uh, and basically, it's a reintroduction of Goldfish to a whole lot of people in Europe and around the world who haven't actually heard about us yet. So yeah, yeah. we've got uh, like some of the songs from Get Busy Living, our previous okay, album, okay. Um, Perceptions of Pasha, and Caught in the Loop, all yeah. together, plus some new songs right. in an awesome package. With and it's gonna be released on a double vinyl as well, which oh, is quite nice, exciting. Nice, yeah. nice, cool, cool. So you guys been busy in the studio, obviously, just uh, too busy. I'm getting sick of Dave. On. I'm completely. How sick does of it work in the studio? I mean, who does what? How do you get your I make vibe? The tea. Who, who do you? You make the tea. Of I course. make the tea. Are you smoking crack and just getting high and like? No, um, cut, edit. Sorry. <laughs> so, who, so, so how do you get your vibe together in the studio? Like, um, what sort of? Well, yeah, how does it work? apart from making the tea, yes. I'm uh, <laughs> Dave and I. Yeah, we've basically been working really hard this year because um, this album's coming out, out in June, and then we're going to have a, a full new album coming out in February, uh, which has to be ready by the time uh, we get back to South Africa. So uh, we've been working like crazy Trojans right, in right, the right. studio, and uh, basically both of us just lock ourselves away okay. every day and and just 
we've been composing, writing, arguing. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You name it, we've done it, and uh, it's we've got some really cool tracks. We're super All excited right, about. Awesome, so. awesome. So you guys are in a beef as well this this coming up, up yep. coming season. Uh, you were talking about Pasha earlier. We chat about it that. We, um, we're actually heading in about three weeks' time to the Pasha Festival in Amsterdam. Okay. And then we're going to the IMS in, in Ibiza. Yeah, yeah. Uh, with uh, we're doing a festival at the Dolt Villa on right. the on the hill there right. with David Getter and Diplo and Paul Oakenfold. Go. It's gonna be awesome. And then um, then we go back to South Africa for a little bit and then we hit. We right. hit uh, the Amsterdam Sabos and London. We play in the Coronet Theatre on the 16th okay. of June, which should be a good one. And uh, yeah, then we're going to be in Ibiza. We're starting our residency at the Blue Marlin on the 28th of June. Yeah, that's every Thursday. It's a okay, okay. beautiful beach vibe. You know, early sundowner kind of set. Yeah, 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 yeah. And uh, we're playing. We just heard, not confirmed yet, but. We heard that we might be getting a slot on at, at Ushuaia as well. Okay, which cool, is really cool. Ushuaia is pretty cool. That's yeah. a, lot of, a lot of hype about that in Ibiza right now. Yeah, and we and then we're going to do a couple of Thursdays with David Getter as well. Right. And yeah, then we'll be touring around Europe like we always do, right. hitting Germany. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And we're playing Extrema Festival in Eindhoven. And with... the list goes on and on and on. I mean, listen, for <laughs> me, it's just like, you know, you, got, you guys have made it. I'm like, I remember one of the first gigs you did at Deluxe when you just started. I remember, yeah. you remember back in, it's just like 2001, 2002 or three. When you just started, you did the show in Deluxe, there's the two of you, just beginning stages, and here we are, you rolling out all these names international. I mean, you guys, you guys have made a high five. We gotta, we gotta do a high five. I'm fucking, you know what I mean? So I spoke to Raymond, your manager, and he's been telling me about the new show you're planning, you know, Goldfish, the next level, the next step. You know, what's going on? What's your plan? Well, we're working on it. We're working on it. On it. Top it's secret. pretty much top secret for now, but we're really excited <laughs> it's about top it. Top secret because we don't know what it is exactly. <laughs> <laughs> no, no, Dave's, I I know what it is. It's just in my head. It's just uh, I think Dave and I we're we're really excited about it. Um, you know, it's kind of we've got that sort of that critical point for Goldfish. So it's uh, it's time we kind of uh, up our up our live show something mm -hmm. that people haven't seen before and. Right, right. Um, you know the main, the, main, the main thing is is we play instruments and uh, yeah. not a lot of electronic acts are actually doing exactly, that on stage. Exactly. And, um, exactly. Dave plays. Some, uh, we, we're getting uh, we're getting a whole bunch of GoPros, little oh, yeah. cameras, and right. we might we get like oh, the GoPro one, camera. Yeah, that's GoPro, pretty cool. Yeah, they, yeah, yeah. They got a new thing they're launching, which is a wireless. The wireless one. Wireless goes one. around. Yeah, yeah. So yeah. you have to have cables, and we can like attach one to the base. So you're gonna get this like camera angle. Oh. They got like super fish eye, so you can have yes. the, the camera just sitting next to it on the base, and you can actually watch Dom playing. I'm gonna do that right now. I'm gonna find my sick. DJing and just like it'll like put a camera on there as well. I'm gonna copy you. Go for it. <laughs> Next question. Uh, come together. You know the cartoon vibe. I mean, who came up with that? We come together. Yeah. The song. Yeah. Well, you know we. We've been wanting to do an 8-bit video for, for ages and our, our guy who does our videos, Mike Scott, who's a legend, an amazing animator, you know, we, we got on the, the horn with him and we were chatting and we were like, yeah, dude, you know, we really, we've got this new song, we want a yeah, video yeah. and like, we're super keen to do like an awesome 8-bit style yeah, video yeah, yeah, and yeah. stuff and we started bouncing ideas around and he was super stoked about it because he, he had secretly been harboring this desire <laughs> to okay. do an 8-bit video as well, so okay, this is okay. like a match made in heaven. And we started bouncing ideas for like, oh, we can put this kind of game in right, and that right, game right, and this right, and that, right, right. and we can we can smack Kesha with saxophones <laughs> and, and uh, yeah, funny yeah. purple things, okay. and uh, <laughs> and we can have Kenny G's brain exploding, yeah, and, yeah, you yeah. Know, and it can be, and we've been. Uh, We've had this thing since we were at university, at, at, at university studying jazz, where yeah, yeah. you know if you didn't do the if you didn't play the right thing, you always say like, oh, the jazz police is coming. You know? <laughs> yeah, so yeah. we kind of did a play on that, and we had we actually had the jazz police were like the <laughs> they were like the protagonists, yeah. and they were like chasing cool. like, the, the main characters through the video, and they were they were jazz cats because right, you know right. like jazz terminology, yeah, yeah, like yeah, 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 jazz, jazz cats. cats. Yeah, so, yeah, yeah. so we sort of flipped that on its head. They became the cats. So the cats were the jazz police, <laughs> and then it's just nice. like and. Mike just took it and he ran with it and he just made this unbelievable yeah. video. It's almost on two million hits on YouTube. Wow, wow. And uh, yeah, he and that's just on our page, it's on some yeah, other pages yeah, as yeah, well. Yeah. And uh, yeah, he just he literally he went mad with it. I mean he did he spent so much time with it that he had in his own words. He went loco. He went he had a <laughs> he had a clutch out. <laughs> right, right. If you ever see some of my music videos when like you'll see one of the characters starts like freaking out, he's like <laughs> <laughs> yeah. That's what he oh, calls. Can we do that again? That's can what he calls that, a clutch out. Again? Which, how does it no, work? No, 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 no. <laughs> no. Only one time only. One take, one yeah. take. Okay. And and yeah, and it's quite exciting because one of our new tracks is he's done a video for that as okay, well for cool. one of the new singles. And uh, actually, the next two, 
The next four singles are all going to have amazing animated videos. Awesome, We've been working awesome, on them. Awesome. Some crazy, some even more crazy shit's coming right, out. Right, right, right. So, well, that's cool, guys. Listen, from the Jazz Cats, Nasimi Beach, no, Nasimi Beach, Sundance Beach, you know, it's African Freedom Day. Thanks for coming down, guys. You're going to be getting on the stage in a couple of. Couple half minutes. an hour, what a couple, couple of minutes. Of half an hour. Looking forward to it. Thanks for coming down a couple of half hours. Keep it fishy. Keep it fishy.